Hey, more like this. Make it a little bit bigger now. Let's get the body going. Just four more like this. Let's go. Here's four. Doing okay there? Very nice. Two. Up. From here. Hold it. We can inhale up. And exhale down. Hands to the waist. From here, we're going to squat down. And up. Again. Squat down on two. Lift up. Now. Watch your knees. Make sure the knees stay right above the heels. So they go down on two and lift up on two. Very nice. Down on two. Nice and slow. Lift. Exhale as you're coming up. And right here, exhale. Do it again. Now let's do this one in single. So you're going to go down and up. Down and up. Pushing off your heels every time. So my heels are digging into the floor. I'm not putting too much pressure on the front of the foot right here. And from here, we're going to add the arms. You're going to go down, lift up, down, lift up. Real nice. Send those arms straight up. Down, up. Keep your torso nice and tall. Very good. Let's do this right eight more times. Eight. And seven. And six. And five. Here's four more. Three more. Two more. Let's take it from side to side. So you're going to go down, side. Now to the other side. Good. Down, side. As I'm doing this, I'm pivoting on my foot, coming up, lifting the heel off the ground, and reaching out. Real nice. Let's keep going through the break, which we are forced to go on. But I want to see you there when I come back. Don't stop. We're going to keep the palms above the knees for support, okay? Abdominals slightly pulling in, okay? So you want to keep your lower part of your back outwards, like you're pulling your abs slightly in, yes? Shoulders stay wide. Very good. Let's do this eight more times. Eight. Good job. Six, seven, and eight. Let's hold it over here to the side. Hold this stretch right here. Real nice. From here, we're going to bring the palms straight down. We're going to start going into the muscle by lifting up. So you're going to go up and down. 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 So you're pushing off the floor. Good. Up and down. Good. Up and down. Up. Do it again. Up. Good. Six. Good. Seven. Let's do this one more time. Up. Down. Third set. Good. Let's go. Up. Squeeze up. Push off the butt. Feel the thigh contracting every time. And this is going to be two more. And let's hold it up right here. Side to side. We're going to take it. Left side, right side. Good. Take it. From side to side. Real nice. Good. Four more. Three more. Two more. Now let's hold it right here. Palm of the hand is going to come down. Now, I want you to keep a vertical position between your knee and your heel the whole exercise when you come to the end position. Palm comes down. From here, we're going to count it. Up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Real good. Up. Nice. Lift. Focus on squeezing off your heel. Very good. Do it again. Right here. Lift. Good. Try to bring the upper body all the way up to a straight position. Now, when I'm lifting myself at the top of the move, my knee is not locked. I'm keeping the concentration on the thigh. Good. Let's go. Four more times now. Go. Four. And three. And here's two. Nice work. Hold it up. Good job. Bring the legs in. Shake them out. Everybody, let's grab one weight. I'm going to go for the lighter one at this point. Okay. We're going to spread our legs wide open from here. Once again, now we're going to work with the weight. Palm of the hand is going to come down for support. This is going to be a little more difficult. On four, on three, on two. Let's go. Up and down. Two. Three. Now use the weight to really focus a little bit deeper into the buttocks. Good. Lift it. Down. Lift. Come on. Very nice. Squeeze. Push off the buttocks. Don't forget, the palm of the hand supports 
at the top of the knee. Good, good, Jay. One, and two, and three. Give me four more times right here. Let's go. Four, and three, and two, and last time, hold. Nice work, switch sides, palm of the hand, right above the knee for support. Other hand comes down, from here we go. Up and down, lift and down, lift and down. Squeeze, real nice, up, good, yes. Come on guys, you're looking good. Yes, let's do it again. Lift, push from the buttocks and the thigh, every time, good. Come on, come on, come on. Keep those smiles, everybody. Let's come all the way up to the top. Good, this is the last set of eight. Let's go. Nice. Four more. Three more. This is two. And now the last one, squeeze and hold. Nice work, come in. Shake it out. Let's bring the weight down. Bend the knees and slowly put your weight down. Always bending at the knee. Then you come back up. Excellent work. We're gonna continue working on the outer thighs for a while. Let's take a flat position on the floor. Take one of your weights. Preferably the lighter one. Okay, relax down. Leg is gonna, the bottom leg is slightly bent. The top leg extended out. From here, we're gonna place the weight on top of your thigh and support it with the palm of the hand. From here, we're gonna start two counts up, two counts down, we go. Up and down, real nice. Up and down, do it again. Stay nice and tall. Again, up. Do it again. Up, two, and down. Do it again. Up, two, and down. And up, and down. Real nice. Yes. Do it again. Good. Can you feel the burn yet? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Very good. Do it again. Good. Do it again. Squeeze and hold. Press with the heel to the outside. Good. Good, do it two more times. Nice. Last one, we're gonna hold it up. Hold, let's just hold it there. Let the weight press against your thigh. We're gonna hold it. Four more, three more, two more. From this position, all we're gonna do is lift an inch and down, an inch and down, an inch and down. Nice, do it again. Lift and down, lift and down, lift. Set of eight, go up, real nice. Squeeze. Can you feel the burn? I can feel the burn. I don't know about you. Let's go. And last one, we're gonna squeeze and hold. And we're gonna bring it down. Good job. Shake it out. Nice, slap yourself on the butt. Those of you who like it, we're gonna do it for two more times and then we're gonna go right back to working out here. Okay. Bring the knees in closer, right here. Bend position. From here, we're gonna go straight up and down. Lift and down, lift and down, lift. Good, squeeze. So this time you're trying to look, look at your whole leg as one unit. So the whole leg comes up, then down. Lift and down, lift. Good, again, nice. Good, good. And this is the last one, we're gonna hold it up. Hold, 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 right here. Hold it, wait, seven, six, five, four, three, two, good job, bring it down, clap. Who loves you? I do, I love you, that's why I'm gonna work your other leg. Let's go, we're gonna switch sides, turn. Very good job, everybody. Where were we? Okay, we're gonna start here with the other leg. So the bottom leg, knee stays bent. Stand your other leg out, bring the weight right to the top of the thigh for extra resistance. From here, we go. Two counts up, two down, two up, two down. Again, two up, very nice. Do it again, up on two, down on two, good. Up on two, you're looking good, keep smiling there. Let's go, good, up on two, down on two, up, very good. I want you to feel the heel extending out every time. Good, lift, up and squeeze. At the top of the move, there's a squeeze. Good, do it again, up and down, do 
it again. Up. Nice. Last one, we're gonna squeeze and hold at the top. From here, we're gonna just stay holding. Hold it, hold it, hold it. So I'm gonna count it eight, seven, and six. Keep pressing that heel out, yes. Four, and three, and two. From here, one inch up and down. So we're gonna go up and down, lift and down. Three, small squeeze. The movement doesn't have to be big right here, okay? Now watch your posture. Yeah, are you in a straight line? Is your leg in a straight line with your spine? That's what you wanna check for. Don't let the leg cheat forward. Keep it in a straight line. So you're working your outer side of the buttocks and your outer thigh. Good. Very nice. Let's do this four more times. Three more times. Two more. Last one, squeeze and hold. Hold, hold, hold. Very good. Four, three, two, and bring it down. Very nice work. Let the weight out. Clap yourself. Good. Work, check that muscle out. Spank that muscle. Loosen it up for me because I want to work it a little more here. Okay, let's bend both knees in. Now I'm at a 90 degree angle between my upper body and my lower body. 90 degrees. From here, palm of the hand is gonna go forward. And we're gonna start up and down. Lift and down. Lift, down, lift. Squeeze, good. Six, seven. Second set right here, let's go. Up, yeah. Nice. Good job. Shake it out. Okay, everybody. Come up. Take your, your heavier weight. Your heavier set. And we're going to go back and do some chest work. So from here, we're going to bend the knees. We're going to slowly lower ourselves down. Hands to the side. From here, we're going to go two counts. Up on two. And press it down on two. Squeeze up on two. And down on two. Squeeze up on two. And down on two. Real good. Let's go check on these guys, see what they're doing. Come on, come on with me. Let's go. Good. Do it again. Squeeze. So what are we looking for here? We want to keep the elbows spread out in a straight line with the shoulders. Okay? Then, as you come up, you turn the weight slightly inwards, right? As you turn the weight in, it allows you to focus onto the chest muscles, squeezing them every time you press in. Okay? Also, let's not forget to exhale when we're squeezing in. Yes? Good. Squeeze it in again. Nice work, Kelly. Let's go. Steve, how you doing here? Very good. Yeah, it's very good. Maybe you need a little more resistance, huh? Squeeze. Good. And down. You guys keep focusing on the resistance. Squeeze, okay? So what you have to do is consciously use your mind, focus in, and every time you lift up, you squeeze into that chest. Squeeze and release. Squeeze and release. Real nice. Let's go. Do it. And again. Real nice. Two more sets. And last one. From here, now we're going to do the triceps. From here, going to press in. And we're going to go straight up and down. Elbows close to the body. Go with this through the break. And we'll see you right here. You know how it is. You miss the first morning. You feel guilty. The second, not quite so bad. By the time the ninth rolls around, you can't even remember who Jim is. How about trying something you want to get back to? Like Quaker multigrain snacks. They're new. 60 calories and a tasty crunch. Cinnamon sugar. Welcome back to Body Sculpt, everybody. We're here to do a little cardio. And we're going to achieve it by doing some kickboxing moves. Everybody ready? Let's go. So you jab, cross, jab, cross. As I'm jab crossing, I'm leaning into the move. Now, the weight of my body is distributed evenly between both legs. So I'm not leaning forward, even when I'm punching out. At the same time, what I want to think about is not locking the elbows on the way out. Keep your elbows slightly bent. Kick, right here. Jab it. Good, let's go. Four more. 
three more. Here's two more. Now we're going to raise the knee up right here. Hop, step. Knee up, step. Same thing. The body weight is still in the center between both legs. Hey, good. Nice. Four more times like this. Let's hit. Step up. Hit. Step up. Hit. Step up. Now we're going to stay on the outside and hit every time. Good. What I want to do with this move, while we're punching, where's the punch starting from? It starts from the back foot. It's going to pivot every time I punch in. Then we're going to take it through the waist. So I want to see a turn of the waist. Then the arm extends out as a continuous motion. Eight more times like this. Go eight, ten, six, five, four, three. We're going to add a hook to this. Watch. One, one, hook, step back, again. One, two, hook, step back, again. One, two, hook, step back, do it again. One, two, hook, step back, do it again. One, two, hook, step back, again. One, two, hook, we're gonna add an uppercut. Watch, one, two, hook, uppercut. Go, jab, jab, hook, uppercut. Again, one, two, three, and up. Do it again. Jab, jab, hook, uppercut. Real nice. Jab, jab, hook, uppercut. Again. Breathe out every time. Let's go. Good. And now we're going to do this non-stop. So you go. Jab, jab, hook, uppercut. Go. Uppercut. Jab, jab, hook. Jab, jab, hook. Hit. Jab. Good. Hit. Good. Let's do this. Four more and really get into it now. Hup. Good. Hup. Hey. Hup. Nice. Hup. Give me four more times like this. Go. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Good job. Jump rope. Check it out. Real good job, guys. Everything is good. Our bodies are pumping. Okay, we're gonna go right to the other side. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Good. Step, hit. Jab, cross, step back. Jab, cross, step back. I wanna see a nice full movement on the cross. Right here. I want the waist to get involved in the movement. Okay? Don't just throw your hands out there. Start the movement from the core. Good. Now, knee comes up. Hit, hit, knee up. Breathe into it. Come on, you guys. Show me what you got. Let's go. Yes. I like it so far, so good. Four more. Three more. Two. Hit out every time right here. Hit, hit, hit. Once again, we talked about it. What are we doing? Starting from the waist. Now, this leg right here, every time the left arm, your right arm is coming out, you pivot, so you send the whole energy from the leg, through the waist, into that arm. Right. Good, let's go. Up, six, seven, add a hook, let's go. One, two, hook, step back, go. One, two, hook, step back, again. Jab, jab, hook, step back, go. Jab, jab, hook, step back. Good. Once you get comfortable with the move, start putting some force into it. Good. Yes. Come on, let's do it again, right here. Are we having fun yet? Let's add up uppercut right here. Good. Let's go. Jab, jab, hook, uppercut. Again. Jab, jab, hook, uppercut. Good. On the uppercut. I push off the foot. Go. Hit, hit, hop, up. Good. Again. Jab, jab, hook, uppercut. Pivot and hit. One, two, up, uppercut. Good. Again. Good. Two more like this. Last one. Non stop. Let's go. Hit, go. Good. So jab, jab, hook, uppercut. Again. Jab, jab, hook. Yes. Keep breathing right through the move. Jab. Good. Get into it. 
and let me see what you got. Four more. Three more. Good. Two more. Yeah. Last one. Good job. Jump up. Nice work, everybody. I'll tell you. That sure gets the cardio system going, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're burning fat calories here at a very fast rate. Twice out, twice in. Twice out. In. Twice out. Nice work, everybody. Good job. Keep it up through the break. We will be right back. Keep it going. Now, please, everybody, are you guys waiting for a special invitation? Look at these guys here, huh? All right. And you are you waiting for a special invitation? Here's what we got to do. Take a hold of your bands if you have. If you don't have bands, just use the weights, the light weights, or use your body weight. Same thing. Doesn't matter. Now, bend the knees slightly. Bring the palm of the hands in right next to the shoulders. From here, we're going to squat. Two counts down. Two counts up. Two counts down. Two counts up, let's go. Two counts down. Now what I'm looking for is opening the knees nice and wide and then squeezing off the heels right into the buttocks. That's where you wanna feel it. So you go down on two, squeeze up on two. Again, go down on two, squeeze up on two. Keep going. Now those who don't have bands, as I said, all you gotta do is take your weights and do the same move. So right here we're going. Down on two, lift up on two. Go down on two. Lift up on two. One more time. Keep it going. And come with me. Let's keep it going. Down on two. Up on two, right? Right. Down on two. Squeeze up. So what you want to do is you want to keep your body away from the center, yes? So you're leaning right to the center of your thighs. Down on two. Squeeze up on two, yes? I feel it. Down on two. Squeeze up on two. Again. Down on two. How many more shall we do? Four more. Four more? Yes. Squeeze it up. Good. Three more. Squeeze it up. You have two more there? Yes, two more. Okay, two more. <laughs> yeah, last one. Squeeze and hold up. Real good job. Okay, hold it. Bring the weights down or the bands down, whatever you've got. Good. Let's place them down. Good, excellent work. Shake it out for a second. From here, let's place one foot, let's place one foot in front arms come out. We're going to go into a back lunge position. From this point, what I want you to do is focus on your quads and your buttocks, holding them real tight. From here, we're going to pull in and out. Pull in and out. Good. This is three. Reach out. From here, pull in and out. Again, pull in. Now, what is the exercise? What are we getting? Come with me. Here we go. We are working on the quadricep of the resting leg, the leg that's on the floor that's holding you. This is what we're working on. So you want to keep the bend right there. This is your position. You lock this position the whole time. So your buttocks is contracted, your quadriceps are contracted, and you're squeezing. Where are we at? How many we got? Four more for what? For the burn. For the burn. Okay, let's go. Hold it. And down. Let's do this two more. Two. And down. Last one, in. Now we're gonna go into running arms. So you're gonna go in and back. Same leg, in and back. Again, in on two, back on two. Go, in on two, back on two. Good, in on two, back. Don't compromise that move, hold it. Back, let's go. This is eight and we're gonna do eight more. Are you guys ready? Go, in on two. Back and two, go. This is two. And out. Stay long. Three. I feel that burn, let me tell you. Here's four. Only four more times, go. Here's up. And out. And up. Two more, you gotta want these two. Let's go, right here. Out, last one, we're gonna hold. Hold this squeeze. Lower yourself down just a little bit. Lower yourself and slowly come out of it, step out of it, 
and shake your legs out. Excellent work. If you don't feel that, I don't know what you're going to feel. Okay. Let's go to the other leg. Shake it out for another second, everybody. All right, and I'm ready for the other side. Extend the arms. From here, we go. In on two, the second two. In on two, take it out on two. Good. Reach out. Good. Pull in. Good. Reach out. Nice. Pull in and out. Again, pull in. And now, come with me. Let's see what we're doing here again to remind you. The weight of the body stays distributed evenly between your heel and your toe. So the focus of the body, the focus of this exercise is keeping your glute tight and squeezed the whole time. Then your quadricep also involved. The leg that's going out is going out just for the mark, just to mark your spot and to help you go a little bit deeper into the buttocks on the down lean. Good. Good. Let's do it again right here. Up. Good. Up. And out. Real nice. Squeeze. And out. Again. Squeeze. Let's keep the torso out of the move, okay? I don't want to see any forward flexion with your upper body. Keep the torso nice and tall. Real good. Six. Out. Here we go. Seven. Let's do this one more time. Right here, and eight. And now we're gonna go into running arms. Right here, we're gonna go up, and sit back. Lift up, sit back. Good, lift up, sit back. Real nice, good. Lift up, sit back, okay? Lift up, don't raise. Keep that leg locked into position. Good, and back. Feel it yet, Steve? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, what? Feel it right here. Yeah, good. Nice, let's do it again. This is the second set, right? Good. Three. Good. Four. Back. Five. Back. You gotta want these next few. Back. Let's go. Up. And back. Two more. Squeeze it and hold. And back. Last one. Squeeze it and hold. Hold it right there. From this point. Watch where we are. We're going to lower the body just a bit. Protrude your buttocks backwards. From here, come up nice and slow. Step it out and shake out. I clap my hands to you. If you guys were able to keep this up, you are good. You are good. Let's go. Okay. Now we're going to work on the back. Let's take the heavy set of weights, please. From here. What I'd like you to do is keep one leg forward, one leg slightly back. Shoulders pulled back, bend your knees. From here, we're going to pull up and two, and down and two. Up and two, down and two. Real nice. Squeeze into the back, and down. Let's go. Squeeze in the back, and go. Let's go. Let's see what we've got here. Okay. What are we doing? You want to make sure your lower part of back Okay, stays pulled out by pulling the abdominals in, right? Shoulders, when you're coming up, shoulders go real wide. So you want to get the lats, the back of the back, yeah, right here, the side of the back. Yeah, feel it? So you pull and you hold, then you come down. You pull and you hold, then you come down. Pull and hold, when you're pulling and hold, the abs suck in, the back widens. Let's do this again. Good. Yes. Three sir. Let's go. Nice. Let's do it. I need some work here. Here's three. Good. Here's four. Nice job, guys. Let's go four more times. Down. Good. Three more times. Nice. Two more times. And this is the last one, we're going to squeeze it and we're going to hold it up. Let's check the position, shoulders wide, abs pulled in. Yes? Yeah. From here, bend the knees and slowly bring it up. Good job, shake it out. Shoulder width apart with the feet. Shoulders back, knees slightly bent from here, bicep curl. One arm at a time, let's go. Right side, left side. That is your left, your right. Go. 
go. Good. Squeeze. Again. Nice. Do it again. Very good job. Again. Squeeze and release. Squeeze and release. Squeeze. I see those veins popping up in the back there. You must be feeling good today, Jim, huh? Feels good. Good. Keep that movement strict, though. Tight. Focus into that move. Squeeze. Down. Both arms together. Let's go. Up and down. Up and down. Squeeze. Up. Here's five. Here's six. Here's seven. And here's eight. We're going to hold at the top. Squeeze. From here, we're going to go halfway down. Down and up. Down and up. And down and up. Good. And down and up. Nice. Down and up. Let's do it again. Down and up. Good. Halfway. Then you come up all the way. So you go. Halfway and back into the center. Good. Halfway down. Halfway up. Look at that bicep. Huh? Looks like a bicep, only smaller. Look. Very nice. That's good. Nice. Down. Lift. Down. Six. Hold it. Seven. One more time. Down. And hold it right here. Let's hold it at a half position. From here, we're going to go all the way. Down. So from here, watch. We're going to go halfway up. Up. Forward. In. Down. Up. Forward. In. Down. Up. Forward. In. Down. Nice. Up. Forward. In. And down. Up. Forward. In. And down. Again. Up. And forward. Keep those elbows close to the waist. Up. Forward. In. Down. Again. Up. Forward. In. Down. Again. Now what the movement forward does is allows you to go a little bit deeper into those biceps. Okay, everybody. You're looking good. I have to leave you for a short break. It breaks my heart, but I'm going to be back here for you when you come back. So don't you go away on me now. Don't leave me here by myself. Good. Body Scout, everybody. I told you I was going to be here for you, and here I am. I'm keeping my promise. Let's take one of the weights. We're going to do some standing abs today. Let me show you what I mean. We're going to stand here with the weight, and now we're going to lunge back, and we're going to turn into the side of the weight, and take it back up. So from here you go. Turn, and up. This is two. Now we're going for third, and up. Real nice. Four. Let's talk about the movement. Let's go. Here's what we're looking for. Not important how deep you lunge. What is important is that you keep your torso lifted, keep the weight slightly away from your body, and then you turn into the obliques, the side of the abdominals, okay? Now, it's not important how far you lift your shoulders to the side either. It's important that you turn from the weight. So you turn and you lift. Real nice. Very good, yes? Do it again. How are you doing here, Jim? Doing okay? Yes? Good. Remember what we said. Not important how deep you lunge. The main thing is that you let the waist turn. Okay? Good. This is the third set, right? Very good. Very good. I'm impressed. Real nice. You got to want these next four right here. Let's go. Here's four. This is the last one. Squeeze it right here and lift it up. Let's go to the other side right away. Let's go. Down and lift. From here. Down, turn, and lift. Let's do it again. Turn and lift. Again. Turn and lift. Real nice. Turn. Very good. Do it again. And watch. Again, keep your torso tall. I'm holding the weight slightly away from the body. Good. Let's do it. Up and in. Real nice. Two. And up. Real nice. Three. And up. Working right into the side of 
the uplinks. And up. Again. Very good, everybody. Come on. Six. Up. Good. Seven. One more set of eight. Here we go. Good. Again. Three. And up. Let's go. Four. And up. Come on. Squeeze it in from the oblique. And up. Give me the best three of the day. And up. I'm proud of you. Stay with it. Two more. Up. Last one. Squeeze it all. And bring it down. Good. Let's quick take a sitting position on the floor and finish up with a few crunches right here. We're going to go up on two, down on two. So you go up on two, down on two, up on two, down on two, lift up on two, down on two. Again, let's go. Exhale as you come up. We are focusing on the upper abs. Squeeze up on two. At the same time, the lower part of the back is pulling into the floor. Go again. Lift up on two and down. One more time. Up. Now we're going to extend both legs straight out and we're going to keep going up on two, down on two, lift up on two, down on two. So what we're doing is we're letting the head relax against the palm of the hand and then we're squeezing into the abs. Good. Again, up on two and let's go check what's happening here. Go up on two and down on two. Real nice. Good, everybody. Make sure as you're coming up, you want to pull the lower part of your back into the ground, okay? So as you're also working your lower part of the abs, and you're also working the upper part of the abs, okay? From here. Don't put too much pressure on your head. Just let the head relax against the palm of the hand, okay? I don't want to see you flexing the neck forward. Just relax it, okay? Keep it a nice long neck, yeah? Good. Do it again. Lift and down, real nice. Keep it up. And down. Real good. How we doing here? Let's do this four more times. Now go a little deeper. And down. Do it again. Lift up and hold. And down. So what you're trying to do is you're trying to get to the top of the move as quickly as you can. Hold it. Then come down. Go. Up on two. And down. Real nice. Squeeze. Up on two. And down. Good. Keep the elbows nice and wide. Down. Let's do this two more times. Here's up on two. Down on two. Last one. And now let's add one leg. So we're going to go up leg and down. Other side. Let's go. Squeeze on two and release it. Again. Lift on two. And take it down. Again. Lift on two. Down. Again. Squeeze up. When I'm lifting my leg up, I'm still keeping my thigh slightly flexed. Good. Lift it. Up on two. Down on two. Go. Up on two. Down. Let's do it again, everybody. You're looking good. Down. Again. Squeeze it. Up. Down. Let's get a nice squeeze in there. Nice. Again. Do it again. Squeeze it. Come on. Up. Take your time. Squeeze and hold. Down. Whip them. Whip them. Let's get those hard abs. Down. Do it again. Down. One more time. Lift and lower. Bring the knees back in and let's go for crunches. Two counts. Up and down on two. Lift up on two. Down on two. Lift up on two. Down on two. Last one. And down. Good job. Let's roll over everybody and finish with a stretch. From here, palm of the hands out. 